Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. Let's start with explaining the differences between async and defer attributes in JavaScript. 1. Async, when you use the async attribute in a script tag, the script will be downloaded asynchronously. This means that the script will not block the parsing of the HTML document and will be executed as soon as it is downloaded, even if other parts of the page are still loading. However, the order of script execution is not guaranteed when using async. To defer, on the other hand, when you use the defer attribute in a script tag, the script will also be downloaded asynchronously, but it will not be executed until the HTML document has been fully parsed. Scripts with the defer attribute will be executed in the order they appear in the document. Here's an example to demonstrate the difference between async and defer. In this example, we have three script tags, script1.js, script2.js, and script3.js with the async and defer attributes. Here's what will happen. Script1.js and script2.js with async attribute will be downloaded and executed asynchronously as soon as they are available, without waiting for the HTML document to be fully parsed. The order of their execution may vary. Script3.js with defer attribute will be downloaded asynchronously but will wait to execute until the HTML document has been fully parsed. It will be executed in the order it appears in the document, after Script1.js and Script2.js. This example illustrates how async and defer affect the loading and execution of scripts in a web page. Choose between async and defer based on your script's dependencies and when you want it to be executed.